Welcome to Richard Banker Web Design Tutorials. Today we're going to be looking at polls and how to add a poll to your Joomla website. Right here you can see that we've got this poll on the default Joomla install. That It's a simple poll. Blogs, yep. That's what I want to click on. I vote for it and the results show up down here. So to create a poll or to change a poll you're going to need to go in the back of your website. So you log in and under components listed there is polls. This is the default Joomla polls component. If you click on there you can see your current poll Joomla is used for or if you didn't install the sample data then you may not have this and you may have to install it. So we're going to create a new poll. And the new poll is going to be called, Do You Love This Tutorial? Our options can be yes, no, not sure. And we're going to make sure to go over here and publish this right away. And we'll click Save. Now we can see here that it's published. Now to, to actually make sure this poll gets onto your website, you can do two things. First you have to go to your module manager. If you want to change the poll that's on your website right now, we have to go down and find the current poll. So here we've got polls. This is the current poll that is on the front of your website right now. And so we'll change this to, do you love this tutorial? And we'll hit apply. So now after this is refreshed, we can see that our new poll is up here. Do you love this tutorial? Yes, no, yes, I love this tutorial. Now if you want to create a new poll, you just click on new under module manager. So we're under the module manager up here. We click on new. And we're going to click on poll. So this will give us all the options for creating a new poll. We're going to put it on the right hand side, we're going to try to put it right behind there, and we're going to entitle it New Poll. And then you select a poll. And we'll just sele select the default one. So we click Save. So if we go on our home page, there's the poll we created. Here's the new poll we created. So now you've got two polls on your website, and it's an easy way to get interaction on your website. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and we'll catch you again later.